Good morning, everybody, and welcome to this vlog. If you are new here, thank you so much for stopping by. While you're here, hit that subscribe button, give this video a thumbs up, and make sure you hit the bell, ring the bell, so you can be notified every time we put out a new video. What is so significant about this morning? So today is Tuesday, June 30th, and I actually took ETO, which is the Extended Time Off Program, for the month of July. Ryan is already on ETO, also for the month of July. We both decided to take it off this month and travel as much as we possibly can. And by that, I mean places that we are allowed to travel and yeah. safely able to travel to. Um, and we're going to be taking all the safety measures. I know you're course. probably thinking, oh my gosh, why are you guys doing that? <laughs> we're in the middle of this situation. Um, we're going to wear masks. We're going to have um, hand sanitizer. I mean, we're going to make sure that we are staying safe. And not and, just protecting us, but protecting others as well. Yeah, that's our utmost priority. Like, it's staying safe and um, doing stuff that we're able to do and not have to worry about um traveling and catching anything yeah so our itinerary isn't etched in stone yet and i say that because we've had multiple itineraries that have had to be changed now because of travel restrictions or countries changing their mind about letting U.S. citizens in. So it's a little bit up in the air, but we are getting closer and closer to a point where we're able to start nailing things down. Yeah. I think we have about four different places that I think are going to be a go. If we are able to hit all four of the destinations that we want, it's going to be a busy back-to-back -back month and we're excited about it because we have been, like everyone else who who likes to travel, it's just been so stagnant and standstill and we are ready to get out there, hit the skies and, and go see the world. But we are pulling into the airport now, getting ready to drop me off. It is my last day and yeah, we'll pick this up in a little bit. Good morning, everybody. It is the next day. It is Wednesday, July 1st, and I'm officially on vacation. Yes, not only is he on vacation this month, for the whole month, it happens to be his birthday month. So we are going to be celebrating all month long. Obviously, we are going to get some work stuff out of the way. We have a couple of orders we're working on right now, but then we're going to do plenty of playing this month. So after we're done working here in the office, we're going to go to our other office, essentially our bedroom, and start researching YouTube videos of different places in, um, we're looking at Punta Cana in the Dominican Republic, we're looking at Puerto Vallarta, and we're looking at St. Martin as some destinations that we're going to hit, try to hit this month. Um, which should make some for some pretty good vlogs, but yes. we wanted to take advantage of me having this month off. Unfortunately, we weren't expecting kind of the pandemic to have this much of a second wave, but there are still places that we can go and feel safe doing so.
so we just dropped off the orders at the post office so those are going out so if you've ordered and you're watching this your orders are on the way and now we are headed home to start planning our month. trips this month yes we're gonna plan our month out and do our research and make sure that everything's kosher and we're able to go on our planned trips yeah so on the drive i did send a couple of emails to a few different resorts in Putin Kana to see kind of what's going on, what's going to be open, what amenities are available to us. So hopefully, I know their corporate offices are in Barcelona, so I probably won't get an email back until tomorrow, but that's fine. Um, but yeah, we're excited to start planning. Yes, definitely. It's going to be a fun month. I'm excited. Well, we are on our way to meet up with another YouTuber who happens to be on an overnight in Austin, his first trip back after a leave of absence from his company. So we are gonna meet up with him and have some dinner. Yeah, so we are heading out now and we'll see you guys in a bit. What is up guys? Look who's in the back seat. Hi, hello. I'm pretty sure all of y'all know Hunter. Hi everyone. He's having an overnight here in Austin yes. and we picked him up and we're gonna go have some Tex-Mex food. Yes, I'm so excited. I haven't had Tex-Mex in so long and never in Austin, so. <laughs> well, Let's go right. eat. Let's go do Let's it. Let's do it. All right, so we have just finished dinner, all three of us. Hi. Chatting and Now Hunter's vlogging. <laughs> How was dinner? It was really good. I love the chicken that was on that salad. It was like a nice like kick. So we brought him to this little Tex-Mex spot like just outside of the airport because everything is shut down now. So we told him we were like, this isn't like the best Tex-Mex in Austin, but it's kind of like what's available, so. We had so much fun. I know, I had so much fun too. It was really nice meeting it was you. Nice meeting. We will definitely have to yeah, um, do it again. Do it I know. again. Let's yeah. do it again. Well, our evening is coming to an end. We had so much fun. We Thank you, you guys too. so much. Of course. I was telling them, I was like, I feel like we did a little bit of a disservice to Austin because we took a drive kind of all the way through. But, but was nothing fun. was open. We yeah. saw so much though. We did. We saw everything. We gave him a history lesson of, of For everything. Real. I know all so much downtown. about Austin now. <laughs> the building, literally, history. So, but we're saying goodbye to him now, and but it's not over yet because he's gonna come back, and I'm we're gonna go back. out there. Yes, I'm coming back. So stay we're tuned on that. Out there and see him. <laughs> and we're gonna. Yes, you guys are no, always welcome sure. in Tampa for real. Absolutely. All right, guys. Have a good night. Bye. 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 Well, we just got home. We had a really fun night tonight with Hunter. Hunter, thank you so much for coming out with us. It was fun. Yes, next time you guys have to come here and visit. We're gonna spend more time in downtown and taking you to other spots that we love and hit up Salt Lake for barbecue since you like barbecue. So after dinner, we went and drove Hunter through like downtown Austin and showed him 6th Street and the 4th Street District and the Texas State Capitol. Unfortunately, with everything that's going on, nothing was really open, so there wasn't a whole lot of people out in the streets, but he still got a really good lesson of Austin. Um, and then we drove back to his hotel, took some pics for the gram, and then parted ways. It was a great night. I mean, we had a lot of fun. Yeah. I will say we took him to just a local Tex-Mex restaurant, so next time we will take you to Gloria's or somewhere that's more uh, More fancy. authentically Austin. Correct. So, but we definitely want Hunter and John to come out here and be able to spend a couple days where we can see Austin in the daylight and then vice versa. We're going to head out to Tampa and go visit them out there. Trolley Dolly, you were severely missed, yes. but we'll all meet up. Well, we are about to put on a movie and call it a night. So we will see you guys Manana. tomorrow. The next day. Good afternoon, YouTube family. Hey, fam. So we are currently headed to Target because we have to pick up a few things because last night after we got home from dinner with Hunter, we ended up solidifying all of our travel plans for the rest of the month. Yes, so we are going to take a couple of trips and um, the first one being next week. Yeah, so on Wednesday, which is five days from today, we set off to Puerto Vallarta. Yes, we're going to go get some sun and PVR. There's plenty of sun here in Austin, but I'm not able to put my toes in the sand here in Austin. But I will be able to do that in Puerto Vallarta. So we're staying at the Sheraton in the hotel zone. Um, but we're not going to just 
limit ourselves to the hotel zone. There's so much to do and see in Puerto Vallarta. And we've talked to a lot of people who have been there or currently live there, and they are tackling this pandemic like a pro. And not gonna lie, I think we're gonna feel safer in Puerto Vallarta than we do here in Texas. There's something like 10,000 new cases in Texas, and we want to get out of Dodge because what we've heard is they're actually taking more precautionary measures, so we feel safer going to PBR than we do staying here in Austin. So we actually talked to a couple of vloggers who reside in Puerto Vallarta today, and she told me that you get your temperature read every time you enter a store, a restaurant. They have antimicrobial gel mats at the entrances to all of these places that you step on to get all the germs off of your shoes. Like they are super advanced in their tackling of this issue. So props to them and we are super excited to get down there. Yes. But we're headed into Target right now, but we'll pick this up in just a second. All right, headed into Target. Vacation mode has already started. I am the worst person whenever like a vacation is near because all I can think about, all I can talk about, Ryan gets so annoyed, but it's fun. All right, so Target is done. We are done with Target. We got everything we needed. Mm -hmm. For all, like all of our trips. Um, we got all of our travel toothpaste and sunscreens and all that good stuff. Yeah, the travel size goodies. Now we'll have to do a test run and make sure everything fits in a quart size baggie yeah. for our allotment. But um, yeah. And since we're traveling non-rev, we only pack a carry-on. So space is limited to begin with, but honestly, we haven't had a problem. I mean, we did 10 days in Europe out of a carry-on and had no problem, so we should be good. But yeah, we got some swim trunks, all of our travel stuff. Um, yeah. Got a button-up shirt, yeah. So I think we're ready. I think we're ready, we did and good. If by Monday, anything we've forgotten, we can always make a run yeah. on Monday or Tuesday. So, um, we leave early on Wednesday, so we're going to fly United to Houston and then Houston to Puerto Vallarta. So this is going to do it for this vlog, so we hope you enjoyed it. Yes, we definitely hope you enjoyed it. Definitely stick around because after this vlog, it's going to be all of our travel vlogs, so we're super excited to put those out. If you are new here, thank you so much for coming by. While you're here, hit that subscribe button. Be sure to give it a thumbs up and... Make sure you hit the bell and get our notifications anytime we post new videos. Yes, so we will see you next time from 30,000 feet in the air.